the way that we're living today. You know the song, don't you? There's no business like show business. Well, what if there was a business like show business? Like show business. I ain't very pretty. Born to hang, they say. But show business is in my blood. I want money, power, glory. I want Harry Starks, they call him the torture gang boss, but he's never unnecessarily rude or brutal. He's a true gentleman, you know? And his world? Well, maybe he's just a product of that. Seedy and violent, sexy and dangerous, glamorous and brutal. Show business is in his blood, as is corruption, violence and transgression. But the story of Harry Starks isn't about show business, no matter what he says. And this isn't a book about show business, even if that's the opening line. Real stars, like Harry, deceive their audience. That's show business. So what's the story really about? Well, it's as the song says now. Money, power and glory. It's about establishments, from Harry's club, The Stardust, to the House of Lords, gangster dynasties, frauds that end in frenzy, and scams, double dealing and double crossing, corrupt coppers and counterculture. It's where the upper echelons of society meet the underworld, gods and monsters, if you like, and who falls into which category. Codes of honour and codes of speech. It's about masculinity and taboo breaking sexual desire, and it is ultimately a story of glamour and violence. Throughout the 1960s, London and Britain are changing quickly as five characters tell their stories through Mr. Starks and his desire for legitimacy. We are drawn into his orbit and it is all consuming. Perhaps we're just more actors in Harry's big show. <laughs> 